Before the Jaguars can open their stadium of the future, they're dealing with some major problems right now, like rats, sewage leaks, and broken pipes. Andrew Badillo is on your side digging into how the team plans to deal with those issues. As the Jaguars get ready to negotiate with the city for a stadium overhaul, they're sharing some of the problems they face in their current stadium. The Jaguars home TIAA Bank Field building failures needs work. This uh, office where the ceiling is collapsed into it uh, and you see where the ceiling tiles collapsed. According to the Jaguars report from 2021 to 2022 there were 3,100 requests for maintenance about six a day. At the top of the list were complaints about food service equipment, electrical systems and plumbing. There were also 204 requests for pest control. We've previously reported on a rat infestation in the Jaguars locker room and rodent droppings found near stadium concessions. The grease traps, you know, uh, they probably have attracted the, some of the rodents would be my guess. Carlucci says an old stadium comes with wear and tear, but added it's important for Mayor Donna Deegan to keep maintenance costs in mind when she begins negotiating for stadium renovation. Uh, talking to the Deegan administration, they're aware of it and uh, they will work with the Jaguars to make sure that all that is brought up. But I like the way the Deegan administration is going about this for the next couple of years and also with the negotiations. We've reached out to the city of Jacksonville to find how much money is being spent on stadium maintenance. We're waiting to hear back. Outside TIAA Bank Field, Andrew Badillo, First Coast News on your side.